containerized compost system is designed to handle large volumes of organic waste. Organic waste that is tough to manage, including food waste from large commercial kitchens and food processors, animal manure from feedlots or stables, or biosolids from wastewater treatment plants. Biosolids is the solid material extracted from the wastewater treatment process. All these waste products are high in organic material, nutrients, and are readily compostable. The installation we're visiting today is located in the coastal town of Westport, Washington. The containerized compost system is well suited to the rainy northwest climate because the sealed vessels won't let weather affect the composting. This three container system is expandable to six containers to accommodate growth in biosolids production from the treatment plant. The containerized compost system is comprised of four custom engineered components the mixer and comp loader, the transportable compost container or comptainer, the aeration system and compost controller or comp troller, and the comp screener. The first step in composting is getting a balanced mix using the right recipe. The comp loader and batch mixer are designed to make mixing accurate and efficient. Four notched augers thoroughly blend and shred the organic material to be composted in weighed batches. When preparing a batch, the mixer is first loaded with a bulking agent such as wood chips or sawdust in order to increase the porosity and carbon content of the mix. The biosolids cake from the dewatering process are conveyed directly into the mixer. The scales detect when the right amount of biosolids are loaded and then automatically turns off the conveyor and dewatering process. The mixer is loaded and ready to start. The mixer runs for four to five minutes to thoroughly mix the batch. Now the batch is mixed and ready for loading into the container. The hydraulically powered comp loader conveys the compost mix into the containers. The mobile undercarriage is powered by a hydraulic motor for transporting and accurately positioning the comp loader. The discharge end of the comp loader is equipped with a high energy flail. The flail will distribute the mix and fill the container right to the roof. Years of research by Green Mountain Technologies has proven that end loading with the flail improves composting by breaking up clumps and maintaining porosity in the mix. The container is a transportable vessel designed specifically for composting. The compost mix stays in the container for 10 to 20 days of active composting. The rugged steel container is insulated and completely sealed. Our patented stainless steel aeration floor evenly distributes process air through the compost. The peaked floor design reduces the pressure loss at the center of the container and prevents short-circuiting of process air along the walls. Gaskets on the doors prevent leakage of process air and liquids. Now the container's full and we're ready to start composting. The container is moved out of the loading bay by a roll-off truck. The roll-off truck is extremely efficient at material handling. This truck is picking up 20 tons of compost. The container is moved out to a composting bay along the aeration lines and connected to the aeration system. Two probes are used to monitor the temperature at the top and bottom of the container and send the data to the comptroller. A good compost mix will generate significant heat by aerobic respiration. Pressurized aeration ducts are connected to each container to cool and oxygenate the compost mass and collect all the process air. Now the comptroller takes over. Regulating the rest of the composting process is automatic. The comptroller regulates the damper position which controls both the amount and the direction of the airflow through the container. The rotary damper automatically reverses the airflow direction depending on temperature readings at the top and bottom of the container. The comptroller also regulates the speed of the aeration blowers using variable frequency drives. The computer controller is housed in this panel. All data is stored here and then accessed remotely by a desktop or laptop computer. The Windows 95 based interface connects any PC via serial cable to the comp troller panel. 
The compost cycle is divided into three time segments to automatically meet the EPA 503 regulations. The operator enters the duration and desired temperature settings for each segment of the cycle. The settings are downloaded to the comptroller panel or can be stored as text files on your hard drive. During the compost run, the comptroller averages the temperature readings every two hours and stores the data. Just select the container you want to see the record for and the software automatically graphs the data. The graph can be saved on your hard drive to provide a complete record for regulatory compliance. The snapshot window gives the operator real-time status of each container. Once again, select the container from the menu. The current top and bottom temperatures are shown, as well as other systems parameters. The program is uh, built for the ease of the operator. The technical support is very good. Anytime I have a problem from Tim, I can uh, just call him on the phone. Uh, he can remotely come uh, program from his office in Seattle. Uh, the working relationship with uh, Green Mountain is, is excellent. Uh, it's probably the best we've had from uh, most of the contractors since we've started uh, building our new plant here. The greatest concern with composting is the generation of odors. The containerized compost system offers three levels of insurance against odors. The first is containment. Composting in sealed vessels prevents the escape of potentially odorous process air. Second is process control. The aeration system maintains oxygen levels and prevents compost from overheating, which minimizes odor generation. The third line of defense is biofiltration. Biofiltration removes odors from the process air before it is vented into the environment. Biofiltration is a simple yet effective process using a bed of stable compost to biodegrade odors. Biofiltration has been proven effective at removing compost odors. Once the active compost process is complete, the container is ready to be emptied and reloaded. The truck tilts the container and the compost is dumped out and ready for screening. Screening allows you to recover the bulking agent for reuse in composting. Screening also removes contaminants and improves the quality of your compost product. You have now turned a waste problem into a marketable product that is beneficial to the environment. Let Green Mountain Technologies' containerized compost system help you expand your waste disposal options. That is our goal at Green Mountain Technologies.